Welcome to the Somme Vigil podcast series, which tells the story of the Battle of the Somme in the words of those who were there. I'm Simon Bendry, Director for UCL Institute of Education's First World War Centenary Battlefield Tours programme. This series was commissioned by the Department for Digital, Culture, Media and Sport and developed in partnership with the First World War Centenary Battlefield Tours programme and Chrome Radio. It was first released to accompany the Somme 100 Vigil at Westminster Abbey, held through the night of the 30th of June and into the morning of the 1st of July 2016, to mark the centenary of the Battle of the Somme. In this podcast, we hear how the fighting on the Somme pushed men to the edge of endurance. Some men arrived at the Somme only to fall ill before or shortly after going into action. Second Lieutenant Evan Jack Lloyd was 23 when war broke out. He served with the South Staffordshires in France in 1915 before being commissioned into the Cheshire Regiment in the field. He joined his new battalion, the 13th Cheshires, on the Somme in June 1916. But in early July he was taken ill with acute appendicitis. In the view of the medical staff, this was brought on by the conditions of trench warfare. Evan had to be evacuated back to Britain. When asked about his father's wartime experience, Evan's son, Patrick, said, So far as I know personally, not a single word concerning his experiences in World War I ever passed my father's lips, and I have never seen any written record either. I have always assumed that this period held such awful memories for him that he deliberately avoided recalling them. You have been listening to The Story of the Somme, a Chrome Radio production for the Department for Digital, Culture, Media and Sport, in partnership with UCL Institute of Education's First World War Centenary Battlefield Tours programme. The producer was Katrina Oliphant. In the next podcast, we hear from a driver in the mechanical transport section of the Army Service Corps, which was responsible for supplies to the front.